Maybe my same interpretation is is that they're great storytellers. I just love comic structure, where As you do mi- I. when yeah. you misdirect people and then you delight them and surprise them, and and, and that is what magic is misdirection. Am I incorrect on that one? Because I'm not a magician. It, it can't, the, it's, it's classic joke structure. I mean, you think the, the joke's going to go one way, and what makes it funny is it goes another. And there's a, several times in the act where you think the trick's going to go one way, and wah-wah, and that wah was the punch. Right. And then the fulfillment of it is, oh, amazement. It, you know, and there's some routines, particularly like last night, it was, it was a tighter uh, uh, time crunch. I'm thinking... I, part of my head's like, no, nah, don't do the trick. Just do the setup and the punch, <laughs> and move on to the next thing. Just get the laugh. Everyone's happy, you know. And, you know, and, and the time is filled. You just skip the dinner. Yes, yeah, that's it. <laughs> Boom. Go ahead. Be funny, you know. But one of the things that you were so good at, and and I think only because I've been in the comedy space for a while, is even your tags and your in between words just came out unconsciously. Like, I don't even think you think about them. I mean, they just boom, boom, boom. Because you've been doing this 30 years or so? Yeah, I've been doing it a long time. Uh, like, that's not rehearsed. Like, whatever that line in between the line that everybody laughs, it's there for you. Yeah, I pretty much know 99% of what I'm going to say up there. But, yeah, it's a function I haven't been doing in a long time uh, and haven't been doing the routines a long time. Uh some of it comes from, and we're really getting in the comedy weeds here, magic comedy weeds, but part of it comes from, for me, the perfect structure for a trick that really is attractive to me is comedy, 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 mind seizure. You know, everything leading up to the end is funny and not necessarily magical, and then the end, that's magical. That's like, whoa, how did that happen? And I dig that because that comedy part allows me to interact with the audience. Whereas, like when I was on Penn & Teller Fool Us, and I did the shell game with them that fooled them. The nature of that routine is there's magic that happens along the way because that's the nature of that show. You got to bring the magic. But most of the routines I do, there's not as much magic along the way till the end. There's funny, funny. And, 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 and maybe it. even misdirection and trick. And, then, and you didn't even really start the trick yet. Sure. But they think oh, you're yeah. starting the trick. Yeah. And then you make a joke because it's funny, funny, funny. And then magic seizure. Yeah, brain that, the amazement part, brain seizure. That's what brain I call the seizure. amazement part. That, oh, how that happened? Yeah, yeah. I want it to be fun. You know, I want it to be fun. Uh, to me, and I got other people don't live by these rules, but these are mine. Magic without comedy is inhumane. <laughs> I mean, it's like, oh, it was amazing, great, great. It's like, I, I, it's, it's not, it's not what I, I, I plug into. 